So something very interesting happened the other day, and I think a lot of people kind of forgot about it. Basically what had happened was Apple released a security update. Now these security updates are very important. They contain a lot of security fixes and a lot of things like that, which are really cool. And it's funny because what had happened was this security update actually was insecure in and of itself. Not insecure, it was basically kind of unsecure, or it had kind of a little weird issue going on with it. Basically what had happened was Apple released iOS 16.5.1a. So it was basically the A security update. It was essentially the, you know, they've done a couple of these rapid security responses. And I think what had happened was Apple pushed out this update a little too fast and they didn't really do their due diligence of actually making sure that this was a secure update. We've seen a lot of things from Apple where they kind of hurry things along and they kind of force people to go ahead and kind of, you know, release an update that may not have been the best update to, to release at the time. And guess what? This was no exception. They released iOS 16.5.1a and essentially what had happened a little bit after is that people were complaining that I guess certain websites weren't loading or Safari wasn't loading, different things like that. And what had happened was basically a little bit after Apple went through and they basically push that update. They basically canceled that update, even though some people already installed it, including myself. I had already installed the update and I already made a video about it at the time too. So what had happened was fast forward a little bit, you know, Apple was basically getting complaints. They were basically saying that, hey, you know, I guess don't install this update. They then released iOS 16.5.1c. So then they went through unreleased 16.5.1a, released 16.5.1c that basically fixed that update. But the reason why this is so important, again, is because Apple did not even do their due diligence of making sure that that was a secure security fix. That was a security update. It wasn't even like a big major design change. So although the update itself was very small, and even though the you know security vulnerability or like the problem that that update caused wasn't even that big, it still is very weird that Apple is pushing out these updates so fast without doing their due diligence of making sure that they're secure updates. I would say within the last year, Apple has spent, I would say within the last year, Apple has actually caused a lot of weird issues that have been fixed very easily or been patched very easily that just kind of flew under the radar of the iOS team. Like I just feel like there's been a lot more issues like that. So I feel like this is just another testament of that. And I really hope Apple doesn't continue doing this in the future. We really don't know what's going to happen, but I really hope and I plead that the iOS team really fixes and takes care of iOS because tons and tons of people install these updates. And I'd hate to have some random issue like that happen if we didn't really need to be there. So that's pretty much it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, not me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.